A woman accused of killing a Plant City lottery winner will stand trial early next year. She's accused of killing Abraham Shakespeare back in 2009. Money's been a huge part of this case. Shakespeare won millions in the lottery. Moore's accused of befriending and then killing him to get her hands on the money. Today, the money question was whether she had the money to afford a lawyer. Hot you mean the one where your son was safe in the room next door, next to a killer that was coming up and getting money? It wasn't that killer that was coming up. Oh no, it was his associate. Oh God, we can trust him. Yeah, ne never mind the actual <laughs> man. He was with him. But he's shady little side worry about is that. Gonna come up and take payments and stuff. We won't worry about that. Don't guy. stay in the house with me, RJ. You can have that nice house outside. Maybe he's come got a knife on. instead of a gun. You got a fighting chance. Come Dee -dee. on, come on. You, even you, have got to see the holes in your story. Even you, okay? This is not a book. This is not a made-up story. This is a real life. And yeah. it's Lakeland, in Florida, life, it, and it, it didn't happen. Yes, yeah. and it's real life, and this did happen. Real life. Care. Real life. This did happen. Real life. Real life. I was really scared. Real, real life. life. You're going to go to prison. James is going to go to prison. And RJ is going to be raised by somebody else. That is not fair to James. James did not. Then you know what? You're right. It's not fair. So tell the truth why and do you, something fair. Why are you blackmailing me? Do something me? fair. You're telling me only if I tell you what you want to hear in the story you want to hear, then James no, is going to No, if you tell me the truth. We don't want to hear a story. We don't want to hear something that you think we want to hear. We want to hear the truth. And, and right now, you, you are mocking two detectives with this fabricated shit is what you're doing. You're telling me there was nobody else there. You're telling me that. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, neither of us said that. What we said was there probably was somebody there, and you know who it is, and you're not telling us. You're not That's telling what we said. I don't know their name, and I'm Dee Dee, sorry. Dee Dee, you do know their name, you know who they were, and you arranged it. Now tell the truth. Tell the truth and save everybody a lot of grief. Let that man rest in peace. Let, let his mom know what properly. happened, and let your son have a father. Do it. Let's be. It's the end of the road. It's the bottom of the barrel. It's six feet under a, a concrete slab. It's time. It's over. Don't you understand? I have laid it out, and even you can understand that. Even you can understand that. I can tell you right now, not even your family can sit on a jury and hear all the evidence against you and not put you in jail for the rest of your life for having that man killed. And you know it's true. Don't A and B and but and because... It's over. It is the truth. It's time to come to grips with the truth. That man died on April 6th because of something you did. I did not have that man killed. There is no motive. There is no reason why There's I plenty of motive. That man killed. There's plenty of motive. I wouldn't do that to There's over $3 million dollars worth of assets of motive. Well, you know what? Then I'm going to go to jail for it and put an innocent victim in jail. You can put me in jail. There's no only one has, victim. Because that is not fair. There's I only one victim. That man. That There's well, you know what? Then go ahead and lock me up because I didn't kill him. I didn't kill him. And if a jury sends me, then there's no justice in this world. So you'd be willing to, you know, you're saying to put you in jail, you'd be willing to take that ride and go to jail and not Because I disclose. can't give you the person's name. I can't. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Who do you want it to be? Who right, do you want we want to be the right person. Tell me who the it truth. is. The truth. Tell the truth. For once in this whole story, please tell the truth. I really truth. don't know their name. Dee Dee, it's not, that's not And it's truth. not, I didn't hire them. It's not some big conspiracy yes, that I hired is. this gentleman to do this. That's in crazy. Fact, I think, well, there's old. been a lot of conspiracy after the fact. Yes, because I was scared. Mm -hmm. Because yes. I knew I'd yes. be implicated. Because I knew I'd go to prison for something I didn't do. They even left you the gun. Why would you think you they were even left you if you were totally gun. innocent? Because... The money, because of everything that did before he left, because of all of that. Look, look, it's all a money trail, and that's what everybody looks at. Now, they just look at the gonna, money we're going to take this circle right back to the beginning and go to the, the, the simple word of greed. That's exactly what kept this conspiracy going. Yeah. Yes, it, it is. Was not yes, it is. I it had invested you, in had a paintball you been field. Scared, I had a, invested in a paintball field so he could get money for Had that. you been scared, had you any heart left, 
you would have picked up the phone and called the cops. I don't Guys believe this crap about a guy putting a gun to your mouth. Okay, well then take me to jail because then I'm you're going to go so to calmly go to. Uh, I don't have me a if choice. I'm wrong with a name, Greg, Greg or Greg, something. Greg, yeah, Greg. And and say, gee, right here, right here, with that little eight-inch piece of metal, out of, whatever. Out of are. thirty by thirty feet, out of nine hundred square feet, and it was exactly about what six point two, six feet, couple inches. Straight down below that piece. Of Out of 900 square foot, you picked the exact spot. But you didn't know that. Ever so resting on his left side, decomposed. With his hairnet still on. And no shoes. You already knew that because it's on the audio tape. You told, you told Greg. You already knew it. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Oh, how oh. did you know that? Oh. How did you know that? Oh. Um, Dee Dee, how did you know that? They say that on the tape. Oh, gee, there's another hole. So let's go back to that story about, oh, they must have lied to me that maybe he's not on the property. I feel better. Maybe he's not buried on my property. Oh, he is buried on my property. Without shoes. Mm, interesting. So how did that, how did you come to know that? I was telling him everything that Ronald told me. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? Going back to Ronald? Are you this guy? serious? You might as well call him Mickey Mouse, Dee Dee. Dee Dee. Didi, this is not just murder. Whatever you want to call him, I don't know his name. Okay, Didi, I don't know his name. This is premeditated murder. How is it premeditated? I oh didn't my, buy the gun oh right God. then. How I didn't she go set through, it up. She I didn't watch the whole go through his entire twenty-minute dissertation of a ten-month investigation all over again. That was and very eloquent. Two I might add. days after he signed the power of attorney over to Judy Hagens, he gets killed. Mm. Dead. Uh, within a week he before, within a week before, you buy a backhoe that he is buried with at an auction. Both oh my God! A backhoe that you really don't need yeah. for that type of property that no, you have. No, we were using it for the paintball field. Uh, James already had mm -hmm. the equipment. Mr. Farkas has all that to equipment. I was having a couple of Mr. Farkas, Mr. Farkas, Farkas, Farkas come over here. Clear that off for me. I was having to pay a lot more for in it. In fact, it was cleared off prior to all this happening. I Before you even bought it, it was you've a lot already, of money for You've people already people been me. judge, jury, and God right now. And God knows I didn't kill that man. So since you're going to be judge, Let me jury, and God, just trust me. Let me tell you something, honey. You ain't never going to see God. Yes, I will. No. Because God knows I no. didn't kill that man. No, right now you won't. I'll tell you that. You're yeah. the reason oh. that man's dead. No, I'm You not. are the reason that man's dead. I am not. I yeah. did not hire yes. that man killed. Yes. I did not. Yes, you I, set the whole thing I up. I did not. And you benefited from it, and nobody else has. No one else has benefited from that man's death but you. All right, so you that's didn't sick. have... Hey, hey. Char. That, that's really Dee -dee. sick. So you, you didn't have that man thing. killed. Char so, is definitely in it. Didi. He, he does not care about money. He could care less. Didi. He could care less what he has. Didi. And look where Char's at right now. Not with you. Is he standing by you? Is no. he anywhere near you right now? No. Where is Char? We know where Char's at. He's we know where Patricia's at. Yeah, he left. He got the hell out of Dodge. You know why he left? Because he knows you're guilty. No, I didn't. Um, know yeah. Him. That's why he left. He said, I That's killed why he man. left. Yeah. He said, I killed him. Yes. Really? Yes. Char said, I took a gun and killed the man. That is why he left you. Well, he you just you told guilty. us that you didn't hire anybody to kill him. Huh? You just told us you didn't, he, you didn't hire anybody to kill him. You have a gun. I wouldn't kill him. It doesn't take much to, to point hire. a gun. And pull I'm not a going to admit to something you want me to admit to. You can send an innocent person to jail because mm -hmm. that's what you're going to do. And no, if you can look at that, what you did, you're going to because mm -hmm. this no, time I you're going to look at how many person look at how many people have been innocently done before DNA come up mm -hmm. with oh, DNA God. testing. <laughs> look at all the people that have got innocently put mm -hmm. in jail. Mm -hmm. I did not do it over. Let me tell you what. Well, none of them had a dead body on their yard. This isn't an issue of DNA. This is a human being that rotted six feet under the ground on your property where you showed Greg where he is buried. That That is what we have. This is, let's not even think about DNA right now. Because we have all the evidence we need, decomposed body. Do you want to know how sick Char is right now? Char is willing to drive down here and give us the keys to that Corvette. 
because he doesn't want something. I don't want anything. Take. I don't want nothing to do with that. He is. No, he's gonna. He's gonna do it. He's gonna come down here. He's not only gonna do that. He's gonna sign that property back to the sheriff's office where he can get turned around and go back to Aber to the rightful heirs of that money. Shay well, Shaw doesn't I don't want anything to do with it. Two hundred thousand dollars that I had put oh, in my account for Oh, back to me. AMP. What about me? What about me? You're talking about the six hundred something you had put in from that account? Come on. Come on. His family said that they were not going to sue me because they know I would not kill His, Let me tell you what, honey. If I put you in a room with his family right now, there wouldn't be any trial. End of story. Because you wouldn't come out alive. There's enough people in his family right now that would love to see you die. Probably is. And rot in hell. hell. I don't know if you watched the news last night, but, but his, uh, his cousin or aunt or whatever her name was, she said she had a message, and it was straight to you. What do you want to have to happen to this person? I hope they rot in hell. That was directed at you. I'm not going to rot in hell because I didn't Well, that was directed at you. I, I hope she him. rots in hell. I didn't kill her. End of story. Okay? So don't think, don't think the family's behind you. Okay. There ain't a soul in that okay. family that's behind well, you. Well, they can have okay? everything. I'd rather live in a you have tried. Box. You have tried. Just Two days it. ago, you were worried about the thing. Can I get to keep, keep my stuff? Can I keep my stuff if I tell you the truth? If I tell you can I keep my stuff? Well, because you keep wanting to... Take my stuff that you're saying that I sold. I sold, and I didn't steal it. I made good money myself, and I did not steal the stuff. I will tell you, I didn't steal. He played you like a drum. What wanted was money. You know that, and we know that, okay? As long as you kept paying him. $5,000 to get a card to the mom. Money here. Let him stay in the house. Car. Everything else. But the minute that dried up, guess what? He wanted his cousin back. So he went to the police and reported him missing. That's and then what did you do? on that porch looking at that lake every day drinking some Bud Lights. That's all he wants to do. And then what's he do after after you start coming back in? Oh, you can have your, gave the car back, signed the house over, did all this stuff to get this heat off of you. Because you knew it was, you knew where it was all going to lead. You knew on November 10th or 11th when I had you down at that office, it was going to leave dead body on your property underneath your slab. You knew it, and you did everything you could, A, to try and make it look like he was alive and somewhere else, and then B, to try and make it look like somebody else did it. You were freaking going to pay a man to say he killed him. You were going to pay an undercover officer $50,000 to say that he killed that man. You were going to have Greg, hey, you were going to have Greg turn around and dig up the man's rotted body. You so gave you Greg the problem. gun. Theory. And you left that trailer with supplies so for that, a rotting corpse. So that he could have a proper burial. Because once I found out he was really there, I wanted him to You knew he was there since oh, April! God. You had your husband drink, drink the coal! For Come on! Wow. You knew where he was what? at! Are you kidding me? You calculated every detail sure of this. He was there. You oh were calculating. my God. You positioned that white Ford truck with a trailer, a nice new trailer, with Greg a galvanized steel tub, Greg was telling me to do that. bleach, Lysol, all Greg that crap. Was telling me Hang to do on that. a minute. And we have you on store video at several locations buying all this shit. Didn't Greg tell me to do that? Re listen to the thing. Listen to the paper. It's Dee Dee Moore on the video purchasing this stuff. Dig up the body. Here's how you get there. You got to go down this far and then over this far. Here's a little angle iron. I'll put it right here where the body's at. Out of 900 square feet, you pick the one spot it could be at. The one spot. And it's right there. The murder weapon you give to Greg, who gives it to me. Ten minutes after you left him, it was in my hands. Very calculating. Come on, Go Dee Dee. ahead, arrest me, and I will sit in jail for something I didn't do. For the rest of your life. I don't have a choice. It for all the rest points to me because you don't want to believe Did you, Would you like an adjoining cell with James? James does not deserve that. I don't think that. he'd want to be anywhere near you. James does not deserve that. That's what he, he does. does. You're right. Nothing. You're right. He doesn't deserve to be next to you. You're right. I, I'll, I'll make sure it's a different jail because I don't he, want him next to you. He does not deserve that. He doesn't he deserve not, to be next nothing, to you. But you're trying to blackmail me by telling me he's going to go to jail. I don't blackmail him. Tell you. There's no blackmailing. Well, then the story I told you. Then tell me the truth. <laughs> I have a don't know the guy's name. Oh my God. So this ruthless killer killed and leaves you alive, a witness. You alive. And you Are you kidding me? me? 
We are murder detectives. We deal with stuff every day. If there's something, if a robbery like that goes down, they kill all the witnesses. Oh no, that's right. You talked them out of killing you. Are you kidding me? The only thing you can talk people into is shooting you. But you continue the charade, very calculating, for several more months. Because I was scared. Because everything was Because you were scared. And it, and it goes back to you moving into the victim's house with a separate apartment or whatever, bonus room, whatever you want to call it, for your 15-year-old underage son, if you're so scared of his life being in danger by, these, by this horrible, murdering, drug-dealing, robbing guy, give me a break. Was your, I, I mean, were, were you less scared driving around in a $90,000 Hummer or charred in his Corvette or... I mean, were you less scared about... I bought those before he even left. He I know, you bought scared. those. knew about those. I know, but he didn't realize that was from that million dollars yes, that you did. stole. Yes, no, he, he did. Didn't. No, I didn't, didn't steal it. Unfortunately, you know what? He's not going to be able to tell anybody. He, he's not going to be able to tell the soul. He's not He's never going to be able to tell anybody. It's going to be your word against this. And guess what we got on our side? Oh, here's the meeting minutes. As long as February I 17th. Say, hey, sh- February 17th. Take him off because he's under investigation. Only one president, D.D. Moore. Hang on. No money was taken out before that, but all of a sudden it's all taken out. Oh, Char, we need to get you a Corvette. Oh, hang on. Here's the other thing. You know that dead guy, that dead, you know, the guy that's buried under my slab? Fuck it. We'll take his car and we'll trade it in and get you a truck. That's good, too. That sounds like a plan. (laughs) That's good. Yep. Oh, well, hey, you know what, Tori, a month late, Tori doesn't want you to have that car anymore. We're taking it back. Take it back. And we'll sell that at Stingray Chevrolet, too. Mm -hmm. Um... The BMW, yeah, we'll sell that too. Um, God, what else? <laughs> Come on. Just sell all, liquidate everything, take some cash. Come back. on, DD. Come on. Think about it. I We've done our homework. Like he was here in February. He knew what I was buying. He let me had give you that. Three, let me give you a three field. word phrase Perception is reality. Okay? Perception is reality. And that's where we're at. Well, I don't think all the people are going to put their hands on the Bible and lie and say he didn't. They're not going to have to. They're going to get on the Bible and they're going to tell the truth. Yeah. Dee Dee Moore is a con artist. She conned every dime out of my and, uncle. And you, know what, you know what just about every person we have spoken to and re interview and correct me if I'm wrong, Detective Wallace, has all said in common about you, Ms. Dee Dee Moore. Doris Moore, is that how the correct pronunciation of your first name? Mm-hmm. She duped me. I feel like an idiot because she duped me. Here's and the these are street smart people that usually don't get duped. These are men that were embarrassed to say that to two cops that were street like, smart. It was not And like they all that. had the same common phrase, Dee Dee duped it me. It was not like that. He yes, wanted to was. be taken off the account when I did that. He asked for me to... Put something up, make it up, so that we can take him off the account because he found out with his Social Security, we got a letter from Tory's lawyer. for, And you can check on that. See when the letter came in. See when I took him off. We got a letter saying that she was suing and all. You can check when we got the letter in. But he wanted to be taken off of that account because he did not want Tory to get a dime of that. And we were talking about it being moved over okay. from that to that. So. He said to, 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 to moved over from his account to this other I'm account. So sure, he said sure to separate it, to get that. separate it, okay. so that way it would be, break it up. And he told me to invest in something so I could start a business. Was and it then the that way he you make, invested in? No. So hold, on, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Was it the Hummer you invested in? No. Okay, was it the he, truck that was an investment? For doing it, hold I got on. 200. Was the truck the investment? No. Okay, the house was the $350,000 house an investment? The house was. Oh, that was an investment? How was yes. that investment? Because he figured that when he came back, he could stay at the house upstairs and work at the paintball field, you know, watch the paintball field and all that. He didn't even talk to people about moving over there. He was talking about that he would have something to do and be able to make money, and then he wouldn't have Tori taking everything D-D. from him D-D. and everything. So, you, so you're going to buy a $350,000 house and put a paintball field on property that you don't own. He's going to come back. If he didn't even lie. Back, I didn't he would have been the, been the first that. person I since Jesus if. to come back. I yeah. said if he come back. If, if he come well, back. He you was think, planning on leaving. Did you think, okay, if he came, did you think you were going to walk out and see the fucking archangel and walking out of the tomb? Okay, why did he pack all his bags up if he wasn't really leaving? That's why funny. That's funny. Hey, up? check this out. There were some boxes because he was going to be yeah. planning on moving. Yeah. He was thinking about moving to the Knight's house over there off of Carillion Lakes. Here's what's even funnier. 
he didn't pack all his shit up because Courtney came back from St. Petersburg on that Wednesday or Thursday, and she went up there, and all his shit was still laid out. It was still in the little in the little room where they were staying. It was still there, and she'll testify to it. And then Joseph Resendez, Joseph, you pay well, Joseph. Hey, mm-hmm. don't don't put it out here. I want you to put all this stuff on a trailer and take it over to that property um, on sixty. You know, I guess you didn't tell him that the rotting carcass of the man who owned that shit was in the backyard. Um, put that out there where the trash man can get it there. They'll pick up all that stuff. And then what did he do? He took a pair of sh- two pairs of shoes. He gave them to Shannon's husband, and he got a pair of shoes himself. Which God, my God, they do have DNA from because they were his stuff. But she gave all that w- that away, all that away. Not all. And then what did you tell? Hold on. You told Shannon, ah, oh, he's got AIDS and he's in Jamaica. He went back to Jamaica to get treatment for AIDS. You told Joseph. What a great place to get treatment. Uh, you told Joseph that he was in Atlanta with some girl, with that girl being Courtney. Um, you know, you've all along you've told so many stories and lies and just it's just because it's I so sad. It's did. so sad. I was scared. Oh my God! Come on. I was. You were so scared. Let's see. Let's move into this house. I'm gonna take my 14 year old son. Hey, don't stay in the house with us, RJ. Where you would be stay, safe. Stay over there. Stay with us. And stay stay, out, there and stay out, out there. On him. Stay out there. Don't worry about it. And, you know, hey, just because the, the guy that killed me, I was able to get all this stuff. Since every now and then, his associate's going to come up. I'm going to collect $5,000. Yeah, no big okay. deal. He's going to no collect it. No big deal. RJ's fine out there. We're going to have a murderous thug come up on our back it's, porch. It's okay because we have an alarm. Yeah. Okay. Well, since you want to say I killed him, I mean, mm-hmm. you know, that's what you're saying, mm-hmm. then just arrest me because you're going to be arresting a, a, a innocent Let's person. Let's do something first. Hang on. I did not kill... Do something first. What? Let me go. Hey, yeah. Go on over the, the houses on Forbes Road and go ahead and. and That's go. not fair. Don't yeah. do that. It's the dude that looks like James. Moore. Okay, I'll, go ahead I'll and talk. Get Don't. Go ahead and go Don't. ahead. Don't. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Are you gonna talk or not? Yes. All right, hold off. But I want Just you to have I want you three three on Jerry Smith. Well, I want you. I want you there off of Jerry Smith and Trapnell and wait for my next call. Do you think we're freaking playing games with you, Dee Dee? What do you want me to say to not hit no, you? No, don't play this. The uh, truth. Don't play this freaking game anymore. You look me straight in the eye the rest and decide your fate right here, right now. Because I got no qualms with locking up your husband with your ass and putting your son in protective custody until we can sort out who can be his guardian. Do you understand me? Yes. I'm not playing any more freaking games with you, Dee Dee. I did not. Have that man hired to kill. If you want me to say I hired him, then say I hired him. I don't want you to say. But he came there. Look at me. A minute. I don't want you to say anything that you think I want you to say. I want the truth. And I will know the truth when I hear it from your mouth based on what I already found out this week. One week is what I have spent backfilling and backfeeding on all the 10 months of intense investigation that that man and his partners have done. Do you think we're just rinky-dink, but they never rednecks believe. from the country yeah, but they putting something together? they would never believe me. It's because of the money trail. They want to say it's me. Because of the money trail. Take the I don't money trail out about of it. The money. Did he take the money, take the dollar signs out of it for a minute? Mm-hmm. Take the motive and all that crap and put yeah. it aside because we've already established that any jury looking at this case right now would hear it, would know that that is the motivating factor. Let's remove that factor right here, right now, and go back to that room where it occurred. Mm -hmm. We're talking about a murder. I'm not talking about a money trail right now. I am talking about the murder. Mm -hmm. Tell me the truth about what happened and who was involved with you before we go to your husband, ex-husband's house and lock his ass up. And RJ is there right now. Do you think I? Do you think I'm playing games? No, I don't. Sit back and talk fair. to me. That's not fair. It is fair. It's reality. It's called solving crimes, Dee Dee. It is law enforcement. I really don't know the guy's name. I really. I don't, don't believe that for one second. And I think, and I know you are involved a lot more 
than some bullshit story of being a victim and having a gun put in your mouth and all that crap when you were so cautiously and callously going over and showing Greg exactly where the man is buried. And then living this concocted life thereafter. The financial records, the movement, the tracking all speaks for itself. You can't walk away from this one. You can't bullshit yourself out of this one. It is over. The book has been laid open. We're on the right page. You want me to say something that's not true. And I cannot do that. I can't make up any more names. I know you can't make up any more names. I know you can't make up any more names because they're all bullshit and fictitious. Ron is bullshit. I really don't know. Has been removed from the equation. I did not know the guy's name. It doesn't make any sense. I don't care if it don't make no sense. It's the truth. It's the honest to God truth. I promise you. I don't I did not kill that man. So you're willing to take this ride with your ex husband then? No, I don't want to take it with him. Charge me with it. Go ahead, charge me with it. I don't I'll take it. Charge me with it. He didn't have anything or know anything. Charge me with it. How'd that make you feel when you popped off those around them? I did not kill him. I would not do Mm -hmm. that. I wouldn't shoot him. Did he say anything? Did he look at you when that happened? I would not ever shoot another human being. That is really sick. Very sick. Very, Mm -hmm. very sick. I wouldn't hurt him for anything. I got his broken finger fixed. I helped him. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't do anything. Did you get sick after doing that? Did you you vomit or anything? No, seriously. I wouldn't hurt him. But you bury him in a shallow grave without a proper burial and let him rot in your backyard. I did not know they definitely If you cared for this man so much. I did not know they definitely put him in there. If you cared for this man. You just, you let the cat out of the bag with a whole shoe come in a few minutes ago. No, that was when I told him, I told Greg, look and listen to the recordings. Well, listen to the recordings. I told Greg exactly how that guy told me it was done. Ask, and, and, and I repeat to Greg exactly how how that guy said it was and, yet, and yet you're left to be alive. A valuable out witness. The truth out there? Nah. Okay. A valuable witness. That's it. That's it. I'm done. Sit down. Sit down. Sit, sit, sit down, down now. That's blackmail. I'm That's done. blackmail. No, That's blackmail. Why can't okay. I go to jail and take the charges? No, Why can't I'm, I'm, I take the charges? Right just say I did it. It's going right now. No, just say no, I did it. Going first. Okay. Just say I did it. Okay. Define how this is blackmail. It's called because investigation. Because you want me to say something that's not true. If we have probable cause, then we're going to affect probable cause. You're, not, you're wanting me to say something that is not true. You want me to say, I did it, I, I, I concocted it, I hired this man and everything. You're, you're wanting me to say that. Your reliability and accountability of speaking the truth is all shot to hell. Okay, well that's fine. But I'm not going to sit there and lie about stuff I didn't do. Go ahead and just arrest me. I'm not going to sit there and lie, and I'm not going to sit there and say... You look say, like I have handcuffs on me right now? But I'm not going to sit there and say I killed the man I didn't kill. you think this is like a TV show where we're just going to put you against That's the wall, cuff you, you, take you off the that, jail? That is wrong of you to did arrest you a man there, Hold on, did you just sit there and say I'm not going to sit here and lie? You fucking have done it since November 9th. Mm-hmm. So you're telling me that James couldn't pass a polygraph to say he didn't have any Polygraphs food. are inadmissible in court. Well, yeah, he never would do anything wrong in his life. What do you want me to say? Do you want me to take the charge and go ahead and say I murdered him so that he doesn't get charged? I want the truth from you for the first time since November. I told you the truth. I don't no, you know haven't. the guy. He no, came in and he... No, you haven't. You have not. Quit yelling at me. I've been nice to you the whole time. You want me to tell you a lie. So you tell me what lie you want me to tell you, and then James can stay there because that's not fair to him. He did not know anything. He is innocent in all of this. And so you're going to put an innocent man in jail. But you are not. 
You are not. You want me to admit you that I are not. forcefully I paid some crazy man to kill that is not true. I wouldn't pay for a man to get what killed over fucking money. What is the truth? So you kill them yourself. <sighs> I wouldn't kill a man over that. So I'm going to take by myself and take a body out of a house and, your, and, and shoot him and and handle all of that emotionally and then handle emotionally disposing of it by myself. Yeah, you don't do it every well. day. Let, let's look at something here. First of all, you asked James, your ex-husband, to dig a freaking hole behind the back door where that garage is. Far enough away from where Penelope the goat can come up over there. Saying to and he that, said, that gee, you know, that's too close know. to a house where there could be electrical and plumbing. That would be very simple to drag corpse a few feet out that well, door do and put him in a to, hole. What do you want me to admit to so that James doesn't get arrested? Tell me what you want and I'll go because I'm going to jail anyway. So I'll, tell I'll me tell what you, you I'll tell you one simple truth. word, the truth. Truth. <laughs> T-R-U-T-H. Truth. T-D. Please. I have given you the truth. I really don't know their name. You haven't. I don't know their name. You want me to give a name. I will try to find out your name. No. But I cannot give you their name. No, Dee Dee, Dee Dee, you are not telling the truth, Dee Dee. Okay? You're God, and you were there in videotaping this, and knowing your heart that I'm not telling the truth. Do you think that I wouldn't tell the truth for you arresting James, an innocent person? He's innocent. No, I would rather say I killed him. If you want me to say I killed him, I'd rather do that than him get arrested for something he didn't do. Didi, I want the truth for you for once. Listen to me. I want the truth for once. For once. I am telling no, you the not. truth. No, you're not. I am Didi, you're not. You're not, okay? You're just not. Listen to me. You're not telling me the truth. You haven't told me the truth since November 10th. You haven't. You know it. Look at what you've done, Dee Dee. Tell me what Look you want me to say so James don't get arrested. Look at what you've done. What do you want me to say? The truth. Just Bring the truth out. No, 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 no. Don't play the game. I've got people on the way there now. Please stop it. Okay? Yes. I got DC Go ahead and no, take no, no, me no. and I'll, I'll sit back, back in your chair. No, I'll sit back in your chair. Sit back in your chair. What? Sit back in your chair. Okay. Please, please go ahead and cancel it. Dee Dee, Okay. Dee Dee, Dee Dee, stop. What? I want the truth. Stop all the charades. <laughs> Dee Dee, it's not the truth. Because if that was the truth, you would have told me from the beginning. From the very beginning. Yeah. Don't from the very beginning you would have told me that. And you didn't. You didn't. You tried like hell to make everybody convinced that he was somewhere else. You want to tore you over. No, I'm don't do that. Please. I don't want becauses or buts, okay? You've played this out in your mind, okay? I see. You would play this. Stop. Stop. Don't say no. Stop. And listen to me. Stop. Listen to me. You lied from day one. Okay? You tried. You tried your damnedest to make it look like you were still alive. You tried and tried and tried. No, don't because. I don't want any more. Your becauses are lies. Your becauses are excuses. And they're not any good. Not at all. No more becauses. Okay? You started the very beginning. Stop that. Listen you to stop me. Stop that, please. Stop that, and I'll just say that I killed him. Come on. Will you please put the stop? Tell me the truth, and I will stop it. I can stop it any time, but you tell me the truth. You want me to change the story? Really? Amen. Amen. No. I don't care. You do know who it was. I I you really know don't know the person. You do know the person, and I know who that person. And who is it? I'm waiting for you to tell me. I think I know. Tell me the truth. Who? Tell me. Who? Tell me. You tell me. No, you tell me. You tell me. It's the time. No, you tell me. Dee Dee. Dee Dee. No, you tell Didi. me. Dee Dee. No, I am not saying the name because as soon as I say the name, you're going to say, yeah, that's it. And yeah, I can't believe you. that. You give me the name. Tell me the man's name. You know, and I know. Tell me the man. I swear to you, you look at me, you look at me, I swear to you, I will do everything in my power to help you out, to help RJ out there, to help James out, but I'm telling you, look at me, I haven't lied to you once, okay, you may not like me at certain points, okay, you may not, but there's one thing you can say, you know, everybody that you deal with can say, I am the most honest person you've met. Did the person already tell you who did it? Okay.
Did I they never admit did. to it? Listen to me. Did they admit to it? Look. Did they admit to it? I'm not going to tell you what I got. Tell me. No. Listen to me. Your little cries and your little eyes, they don't work with me. Tell me. You tell me. No, you Look, tell me who remember. I already know, so you tell me. No, you're not going to hear it from me. Tell me the truth now. The truth now. It's the time. Tell me the truth. Why does James go to jail? Because I don't know the guy's name. No. Dee, look Why didn't you just let stop, me say stop, I did it? Why stop, can't I be charged with it? I'll admit, I, no, I'll say I killed him. No, it's not the truth. I am the truth. I'll say I killed him. No, it. tell me the truth. You know I know the truth. Look in my eyes. You know I know. You know. No, you know that's not how the game's played. I told you I'm a lot better than you. All right. If you knew who it was, you would have already arrested him. How do you know I'm not with him now? I'm not going over here. Okay. You know I've got unlimited resources. You know this. So you got somebody else here? Yes, I do. And not necessarily here. I have people all over. Now tell me. You have James and who? Tell me the truth. Who do you have here? Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth now. We're at the end of the line. We are at the end of the line. This, that person will kill me. No. They won't. That person I will protect you from. Tell me the name. Right you will protect me from that person. You tell me the name and we will take care of the problem today. Tell me the truth. How do you know about me? Look, I'm good at my job. Tell me the truth. How do you know about me? I'm not to answer any questions. You are. It's not my future. It's not my family's future to come along here. It's yours. Okay? This isn't the con game. Just talk to me and make me tell you stuff. No, but it I doesn't just work. want to it know that you work. really know. Look. Because if you really know, then I, it's not like I said that way. I don't say it. That way it doesn't come from no. me. I don't have to you have to say it. Say it. You have to no, say it. No, that way they don't have to kill me. They don't want to kill me. They can say it. No I one's going to kill you. You figured it out. No one's going to kill you. You tell them you figured it out. Tell me. The, don't you, you worry when I tell them. No, you, you tell them you figured it you out. You tell me the truth now. No, you tell them you figured it out. I will tell them what I have to tell them. You tell me the truth. Tell me the truth. You tell them you figured it out. It's not worth it. I will. Don't worry. Your son's not going to be killed. You How tell you me the know? truth. Because I know. How do you know they won't hire someone? Do you not think I'm good at my job? Do you not think that I'm one of the best there is? Mm -hmm. Okay. Leave it at that. Okay, tell me the name. You know I do what I do. Now tell me the name. And they're already here. Tell me the name. I want you to tell me. Tell me the name. Times are now. Well, I'm Tick -tock. I don't I can't be the one to say. Tick tock. Time is running out. Tell me the name. I don't want time to run out. It's running out quickly. Tell me the name. How did you figure it out? Look, I am better at my job than 99% of the people out there. Mm -hmm. Okay? End of story. You don't have to know how I know what I know. How did I figure out Greg? How did I figure out everything else? Because I'm good. End of story. So you know it. What? Tell me. That's fine. Tell me. No, 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 no. I'm tired of playing this game. Okay. Tell me now. I'm telling. I'm not telling you a thing. Until it comes out of your mouth, I am not telling you a thing. Tell 
me the truth, man. Don't tell the truth except for the person's name. I'd rather go to jail. Then give me the name. I told you what the deal is. I get the name, or who goes to jail, I've already told you. That's not the case. No, that's, uh, that's reality, okay? If you want to go to fair, it's fair is a place where you go ride a fucking carnival ride, okay? We ain't living in that. Oh, yeah. We're living in reality. Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth. Give me the name now, or I'm telling you right now, it's over. Okay? You see that big hand? By the time it hits 60 again, you better tell me, or I'm walking out of the room. The little red hand. You've got 52 seconds left. And I walk out. And it's done. No, listen to me. 44, 43, 40, 41. Huh? Tell me now. Give me the name. Greg, who? Tell me what happened. He ran with the other thing and I was asking me to write the sentence. And he threw the killing. And he took the truth. And he was done. What gun? and doing are two different things. Tell the truth. Okay? I'm tired of the lies. Tell the truth. I really don't like the guy. No, 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 no. He is, he is. No. That's not the truth. You already started off with a lie. That's bullshit, okay? Tell the truth. Tell the truth. Why did you do this with me? Tell the whole truth. Tell the whole truth and tell me what happened. I'm saying that you don't think you missed anything. 
dollar store. Then tell me how it happened. He's dollar store. Okay. Then tell me how it happened and explain it to me. And ex okay. Maybe you didn't think you were going to kill him. I don't know. You got to tell me the truth. Right now, the whole truth puts it on you as a cold hearted, cold blooded murderer. End of story. You know as well as I do, and that's why you sat there with your eyes closed while I told that the whole thing. You know what that tells. That tells the story of a person who is a cold blooded killer. Okay? And the only way to get away from that is to tell the truth. Okay? That's it. That is the only way. Because right now, I'm not getting you. Well, the story, the, the whole story puts you and James in jail forever. Forever. You know? And forever could end up with a. Can you do that now, Andrew? Get me out of the That's not going to happen anytime soon. Listen to me. Tell me the truth right here, right now. Tell me the truth that I can walk out there and I can say, you know what? She's finally told the truth. It's finally there. Can yeah, I drink water? Not just water, but start with the truth and I'll get you water. Did you get one? Mm -hmm. I hope so. Why won't you just let me kill No. Kill them Listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. Everybody Listen to me. What? I'm going to get the water. I'm going to hand you the water. I'm going to sit in that chair. The first bit of lines I get, I walk out that door, and it's done. Okay? You know and I know you're ready to tell the truth. Now do it. The truth. I hear him coming with the water right now. you do when you think is you try and come up with some other story. Don't I know do it. You want me. Don't do it. Beat it. Don't do it. Okay? You really want me to give you a name. I want you to give me the truth. I don't I want know. you to give me a name. I want you to give me the truth from beginning to end. Okay? Let's start April 6th. Okay? You go and you pick him up. Now lead me through it. Step by step. Um, we get diapers and we go to our truck. So, um, Judy is at Hard Rock waiting for us. It was supposed to go by. Um, somebody called him just before he left. Thanks for what? It's on his phone. Okay. Do you want to talk to me? Go ahead. I already know who we talked to. Huh? I already know who we talked to. Not 
not true. Not true. Time, tick tock. <laughs> tick tock. I'm getting tired of the game. Okay? They lost. Okay. We've admitted then, to that. Then, then We've admitted then, to that. Then, then, We've admitted to that. What? That the game's over. Okay? It's the end. This is the end game. Okay? Why do I like this? Why do I like this? No, you do. You do. You do. Okay? We sat here and you've been this close at least three times to tell them the truth today. Okay? I can read you like a book, baby. Tell the truth. You get Judy at the hard rock. Tell me what happens after that. told you it ain't easy. It ain't easy. Tell the truth. No, not, not a lie. Tell the truth. End the story. End it right here. End, end, end this story tonight. End this story now. Tell the truth. Quit crafting things in your mind. Okay, the truth is the truth. The truth is April 6th. The truth is now. The truth will be the same today and will be the same tomorrow and the same next year. Tell the truth now. It's not easy, but I promise you, I promise you, you will feel, you don't even realize how much better you will feel when you tell the truth. I would feel better if I knew the fucker's name. No, that's not the truth. Tell the truth. Quit letting this little thing in your mind go with these stories. Stories are done. Tell the truth. What happened that night? Leave me from the beginning. It's yeah. not fair. No. That I have to. That I have to. To tell the truth? No, it's not fair that I have to make up a story to keep no. my ex-husband out of jail. I'm done with you. I can't do any more. Okay. I can't do any more. That I killed him. No. And let me go to jail for it. I no. killed him. But no. Tell me the that. truth. Tell me the whole truth and run it through it and make sense to me. I know what happened out there. Tell me the truth. Well, then why haven't you arrested that person? Tell me the truth. All my stomach keeps growling too. Mine does too. I've been eating in three days. I don't know how healthy that is. It's not good, but tell me the truth. Mm -hmm. All right, end it. Just end it here. End it now. Get it out. Get it off your chest. Get it off your back. Your shoulder. You, you got a million pounds on your shoulders, and I can see it. You know it, and I know it. Now come on. Get it done. Your only deal that's coming right now, you came in here to talk to me, right? 
You want to talk to me, right? And tell me the truth. I am giving you my word. I will get you the best deal you can ever get. Okay? End of story. I will give you the best deal you can ever get. If you want to tell me the truth, tell me the truth now. Getting a little signs from you. There was no concrete there. you taking a lie detector test with what you just told me. I don't think you're going to pass. Are you going to pass it? Because you know they work. Because you failed the first one we gave you the first night. Well then, yeah, it, I failed it. I, I passed it though, but I didn't kill him. No, you did not pass that. You didn't pass any part of that test. Oh, you said that I failed that I killed him? Look, listen to me. Listen to me. Mm -hmm. The truth is the truth is the truth. Okay? I want the whole, 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 whole truth. Do you understand that? But to get the whole, whole, whole truth, you're wanting to arrest my ex husband if you don't want it. You know what I mean? I don't want to craft this I story. Don't know. Believe me. Because that's not the truth. Oh, God. That is not the truth. 
prove. Come on now. Well, take me a polygraph. Let's see if I can pass this. No, you're telling me right now. You just told me you lied. You just told me you lied. Can you just break down and tell the truth? Tell the truth. Please. Please. If you've never done it once in your life, tell the truth. Come on. You know that's not the truth. You know what's the truth and what ain't. And you get these things and you get serious and you want to look at me and then you want to rake the tears and you want to do this. Come on. Stop the games. Stop the games. Why? I don't understand why I can't get arrested and wait and and because it's not all the truth. I just want the truth, okay? The truth very well may be you shot him, but the reasons ain't what you give. What's the reason? I'm not telling you the reason. You You're know? saying it's uh, money and and stuff you like that. You tell I, me the I, reason. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. You can just you tell me the real reason. Come on. I want you to run it. Come on. Come on. Well, you're wanting me to say that I would kill him, and you're wanting me to say that I would have a other dude. And that's what you're wanting. You're wanting a made up story. No, I'm not. Yes, no, I'm are. not. If I were a made up story, I would have stuck with some of the 300 of my heard since it started. But you want a made up story. You want whoever you want. And, you know, you want a made up story because you want me to say that I hired some hitman. I didn't say you someone. I didn't. And you want me to say that or I killed them. And I, I can't do either one of them. But I'd rather do that I killed them before my ex goes to jail when it's something he hasn't done. tell me done. the truth. Just tell me the truth. It's that simple. It is that simple. Why do you find it so difficult to tell the truth? Because the truth's ugly. I know the truth's ugly. I'm prepared for ugly. Okay? I'm prepared for the ugliest thing I've ever heard. That's fine. You need to tell the truth. That's all. It's easy. That's not easy. It's hard. But it makes you feel better when you're done. Come on. It's really, it's checkmate. There's no other moves. There's no other lies. There's no other stories. There's no other any of this. Because there's evidence to back up the truth. So if you have evidence, then why don't you arrest that no. person? You have to talk. You have to talk. If you want help, if you want out of this, you have to talk. Well, why don't you arrest that person if you have evidence? Until you tell me what happened. I'm giving you the opportunity of a lifetime. Mm -hmm. I really am. To tell the truth. It can't hurt you any worse than you're hurt right now. I, I, I'm willing to go to prison for the rest of my life. Put me in life in prison without parole, all of that. Tell the truth. Tell the truth. The truth will lessen any pro any penalty you will ever have. Tell the truth. Even if it's cold-blooded... I wouldn't do that. Well, just listen to me. Even if it's the cold-blooded, hardest thing you've ever heard in your life, it I'm telling you, it's going to look a hell of a lot better for you when we're standing in front of that judge, and it's time for the judge to make the real determination of what happens to Dee Dee Moore. Yeah, but see, what happens is my lawyer takes it to the judge, and he makes a plea deal. You're making me make it tonight without a deal, and forcing me because of James holding I'm him not, over my head. I'm not forget about James. I'm not holding nothing over yes, your head. Yes, because you're saying you're going to arrest him, and he's an innocent party. He's an innocent Don't, victim. Look here. Don't worry about James. 
I'll t- take James off the table right so now. So you won't arrest him? Take James off the table right you now. You won't arrest him. Well, then you arrest me, and I will talk to my lawyer and see what I can tell you. So you. that's your final answer. You want to talk to your lawyer? And you? If that's your final answer, tell me. If you came down here to talk to me, we'll talk. But if you want to talk to your lawyer, that's fine. That is up to you. I want you to tell me the truth. I want to walk out of here with the truth. But I'm not forcing you. I'm not playing your hand. I'm not playing a game. I'm none of that. I'm just telling you it's the end. It's the very end. Okay? But you're not going to blackmail me and put James on the table. I have never blackmailed you at all. Well, putting James on the table is because you know he didn't have anything to do with it. That's not fair. No, I don't. No, I don't. What I told you is the evidence right now looks like you killed him and looks like James helped you cover it up. So, you know. You take James off the table. I just told you. I'm, James is off the table, okay. okay, at this point. But what I'm telling you about James is right now, with everything we've done, this isn't my whole case, obviously, mm-hmm. okay? But with what we've talked to James about and what we've talked and to, and listen to, to me, you listen to me, know. listen to me, that you admitting something like that isn't good enough. The only good is the truth, Okay. And we've heard 18 truth. different versions of the truth from you. That is the truth. Huh? But we need yeah. the whole truth. Do you understand that? Yeah. yeah. You know, part truth, you, you telling me 30 lies and then telling me one thing and telling me that's the truth doesn't fly. You know? If I sit here in this room and I go, that's a beautiful green wall and that's a beautiful pink wall and that's a beautiful yellow wall and the sky is in whatever color. And all that, and then I finally say, and your blue shirt, your black sweatshirt, what part's the truth? When do you stop, stop believing me? Mm-hmm. You know? Do you want to talk to me? Do you want to get this off your chest? Do you want to end this here tonight in this room? Here's the deal, Dee Dee, here's the deal, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law, okay? You have the right to an attorney, okay? You have the right to have an attorney here with you before and during questions if you wish, okay? Having those rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me now? That's up to you. I'm not going to force you. I'm not going to make a deal with you. I'm not going to do anything, okay? What I'm going to tell you is simple, okay? If you tell me the truth, the truth and nothing but the truth, okay? Tell me who was involved. Tell me why it happened. Tell me everything, okay? I will go to bat for you if need be, you know? But it's time. You Here's the thing. to make up a name, and I really no, don't I know don't. the name, so just arrest me. Okay. You want to arrest me tonight decision. or tomorrow? Then you made your decision. Stay right there. Good morning. Be right back. Be right
just hang on a minute. Do you need to use the restroom, did you say? No. Okay. I'm okay. Yeah, stay here. Okay. Okay. Alright. Who uh who are you working with as your attorney? Um, Lexi Franklin. And that contact information? Numbers, anything? Eight six three six nine eight two two seven. Hang on, slow down. Eight six three. Six nine eight two 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 seven. And what's his name again? Rusty Franklin. Where's he located? And again, you've uh, talked to, or you've communicated, you came here, you met us. Um, we've had this discussion. You've had your discussion with Detective Wallace. Uh, have you been in contact with your attorney? I mean, does he know you're down here? Or? No, because y'all don't, the way it is with you, I don't have an so option can you, can because you, you arrested me. Wait a minute, me. can you just answer a straight question? No, he does okay. not know I'm coming Is he here. expecting you or is he expecting a phone call? I mean, are we, are no. we going to be able to set some up and sit down and hash some things out and sit down and talk with him or what? We can, yes. Uh, he does not expect me a phone call because he didn't know because I didn't know that I was going to get, you know, like, you don't listen to what I have to say. Or you do, you do, but you don't we've believe it. Uh, don't believe it so. We've been listening since 4.05 this afternoon, I know, Dee Dee. I know, but you don't believe it. So... I thought that if I came down here, you would actually believe it, and so. Hey, wait, let me ask you a question. What what did okay. you what did you want us to do to believe? Is what I don't understand. You know, I, I mean, you self admittedly tell me you told me five different stories. What is it? Because you to? were you were blackmailing me, Timmy. You, you're gonna arrest there, my there ex husband. No there is no blackmailing. It's all factual. But he did it's not all have nothing to do with statements, and that's not fair. For the investigation. So if if that's you know. Yeah, but that was not is. fair using him as the. Well, if you don't tell me the story I want to hear and that I believe, then I'm gonna arrest your ex husband. You know that's blackmail. This, the fact right. the fact is, Dee Dee, your husband he admitted had, he had no he admitted idea. to digging the freaking hole. That's all I'm gonna